These friendly looking critters may seem like the ultimate snuggle buddies. However, reaching out to pat them on the head might be the biggest mistake you ever make. Looks can be deceiving as heck, and the last thing you want to do is let your guard down before these cute but dangerous animals. You'll definitely want to think twice about cradling your neighbor's pet chimp after watching this. Red Foxes For anyone who saw the Disney classic The Fox and the Hound, it probably isn't hard to view these beautiful creatures as adorable and loving. As cute as they may be, red foxes are known carriers of rabies. One nip from a red fox and you could be rushing to the ER for a rabies vaccine. Most foxes won't attack a fully-sized person, but they have been known to nip at younger children and family pets. They'll usually perceive anything smaller than themselves as a possible meal. Most fox bite victims are those unsuspectingly trying to make friends with these wild beauties. Chimpanzees No matter where you go in this world, you'll likely always find someone who felt the need to have a chimpanzee for a pet. Apparently, golden retrievers became too passe for some. Anyway, chimps aren't just cute and perceived human-like in behavior, they are also extremely dangerous animals. These social and intelligent apes are still wild creatures. While cute and easily influenced when young, they won't hesitate to throw their weight around and go into a violent fit when they get older. Aggressive chimps have resulted in some pretty vicious scenarios and they are definitely not recommended and in some places illegal as pets. Mute Swans Mute swans may have all the grace and beauty of English royalty. However, beneath that royal exterior is a thug mentality. It may shock you to find that these beautiful creatures are actually the bad boys on the block. If you go to the park and sit by the lake, you'll notice almost every swan lifts its head in your direction. These birds aren't just extremely territorial, but also overtly aggressive. They are especially wary of humans entering their space, especially if they have their young nearby. Mute swans are basically itching to attack, and they aren't easily intimidated by size. These birds have been known to attack even full-sized boats that have breached their territory. Bottlenose Dolphins Most people view dolphins as the peacekeepers of the sea. If you're stuck out at sea and spot a dolphin coming toward you, you'll probably feel a great sense of relief. But better think twice before approaching these aquatic mammals in an unsolicited manner. These seemingly smiling creatures seem harmless and playful enough, but they don't always abide by their friendly reputations. In terms of humans, swimmers trying to get close to these dolphins don't always get the free-spirited joyride they'd hoped for. On a bad day, agitated dolphins have been known to lash out at people, which can result in prolonged hospital stays or worse. Moral of the story, don't project fantasized dreams of swimming with Flipper onto wild bottlenose dolphins. Panda Bears Over the years, people have become nuts about panda bears. You can catch them on advertisements, company logos, on snack packaging, and in Hollywood movies. Most people would love nothing more than to cuddle up with these fluffy bears and use them as big, gigantic pillows. All adorable rolling aside, these are bears and somewhat dangerous animals. The constantly snacking creatures pack a ton of muscle, and a lot of that muscle is in their jaws. A panda can bite through almost anything as if it were butter. Tip, stick to chow chow dogs and leave these merciless munchers alone. Hippos When it comes to the most dangerous animals in Africa, look no further than hippos. Shockingly, they wipe out more humans a year than lions, gorillas, and other large predators in the continent. The hippos aren't exactly seeking out prey either, people just don't take them as a serious threat. While hippos may appear huge and lumbering, they can actually be quite aggressive if provoked, and they are very easily provoked. If they feel threatened, they won't hesitate to charge someone and use their giant teeth as weapons. Don't believe you'll be walking away if you find yourself between their jaws, as they have some of the biggest and strongest teeth in the animal kingdom. Hedgehogs most people were introduced to hedgehogs when they first played Sonic back in the 1990s. Many of us were shocked to find out they weren't blue and didn't run at super speeds. Hedgehogs are actually small and adorable creatures that look completely harmless. That said, don't ever judge a book by its cover. 
Their backside is covered with an array of quills that can pierce human flesh with ease. Don't think you'll rid yourself of the problem by simply pulling them out and getting a band-aid. These quills will immediately inject bacteria into the body and result in a handful of flu-like symptoms. Leopard Seals Seals have been called the dogs of the sea. They smile, make underwater melodies, and remind us so much of swimming versions of our four-legged friends back home. It's all fun and games when they're at SeaWorld catching fish tossed at them by a trainer, but things are different out in the wild. Leopard seals are vicious hunters and have even been known to drag the occasional human snorkeler underwater. It isn't enough for the leopard seal to just hunt their prey, either. These deceivingly adorable whiskered predators like to toy with their struggling victims for quite some time before eating it. No matter how cute they look reclining on the ice, approaching the leopard seal is not a good idea. Two-toed sloths Unless you're a zoologist or some kind of sloth expert, chances are you won't be able to tell the difference between a two-toed sloth and a three-toed sloth. Sadly, for the touchy zoo-goer, that difference can mean life and death. Don't be tempted by the adorable image of a two-toed sloth hanging on a branch and unknowing walk into the arms of one of the world's most dangerous animals. The two-toed sloth may look nice, but really they're just extremely apathetic. They might not mind a quick pat on the back, but if you annoy them, they could turn up the speed and put their two massive claws to use. Don't believe that you'll be walking away just with a few scratches either. So cute, so vicious. Cassowaries A cassowary may look cute and colorful, but this bird is no cuddly cockatiel or meek parakeet. This is the largest bird on the planet, and a dangerous one at that. In fact, the cassowary is the closest living descendant of the prehistoric velociraptor, if that gives all you Jurassic Park fans a hint. These birds won't bite or peck a victim into a corner. Their strength is all in their feet and large talons. They can jump one meter into the air and use their talons to easily slice through limbs. If you ever visit Australia and come across one of these birds in the wild, do not turn your back on them. In that situation, it's best to face them and slowly back away. Good freaking day, mate. Pufferfish the pufferfish is quite endearing from the outside of an aquarium. They'll look at you with inviting eyes that seem to say, come in and pet me. You know you want to. However, putting your hand anywhere near this fish's chubby little face would be a dire mistake. It isn't going to make the cute baby noises you'd expect it to make. It's going to bite your finger. As if a bite isn't bad enough, the pufferfish has venomous teeth. The bite can lead to a paralyzed diaphragm and shortly thereafter, asphyxiation. Just one of these little venomous vixens has enough poison in it to take out 30 humans. Thanks, no thanks. Kangaroos Kangaroos look so innocent hopping along the Australian landscape that their powerhouse fighting abilities can literally smack the unsuspecting in the face. Much like humans, kangaroos fight with their hands and legs. The big difference is the amount of power that they punch with. Mike Tyson can eat his heart out next to a kangaroo. An even worse threat is a kangaroo's kick. You've never seen super strength until you've seen this mighty marsupial use its feet in battle. Their legs aren't only extremely powerful, but their feet have nails that are sharper than a beaver's teeth. For anyone planning adventurous expeditions in the outback, heed this as a warning. Wolverines when looking at pictures on the internet, it isn't hard to mistake a wolverine for an odd-looking house baby bear that you can't help but want to feed and cuddle. However, these are some dangerous animals for humans to interact with. These beasts can get up to about 60 pounds and are capable of dominating animals up to four times their size. There is very little chance that a human can outrun a wolverine in the wild as they can move at speeds of some 30 miles per hour. Given their aggressive attack style, we wouldn't want to lose a race with this cute but dangerous critter. Wolverine from the X-Men franchise might be fictional, but the inspiration for his ferocious abilities certainly is not. Giant Anteaters Upon first glance, giant anteaters look fairly docile, clumsy, and nothing like some of the ferocious beasts we see on Animal Planet. One would be super quick to assume that they don't have an aggressive bone in their oddly shaped bodies. However, under their cute facade are some pretty fierce abilities. They have four-inch claws that can easily cause some gnarly damage. 
Don't take them to be the type of animal that will go out looking for trouble. They won't be picking any fights, but will definitely hold their own if they need to. These animals have been known to lay beatdowns on jaguars and pumas that have invaded their space. Slow Loris A slow loris is a pretty defenseless looking animal. The slow embrace and those puppy dog eyes don't exactly set alarm bells off in our head. However, it has the power to take down any human if it wishes to, or even accidentally. This little doughy-eyed primate has glands in its elbows that are completely laced with venom. If a slow loris feels threatened, they'll lick up the toxic juices and transfer it to their tormentors via a bite. The bite itself will feel pretty terrible, but the venom is only fatal to those who are allergic to it. No matter how cute and gentle these animals may be, they ultimately belong in the wild and are not to be kept as pets. Duck-billed Pilatipus There are a lot of strange animals in our world, and we're willing to bet that the duck-billed Pilatipus is one of the strangest. This egg-laying mammal looks like the hybrid result of a romantic encounter between a duck and a beaver. Judging by how cute they are, especially as freshly hatched babies, we'd say it's a nice if not somewhat odd mix. Apart from their unconventional cuteness, they are unique among mammals as they are one of the few venomous mammals on Earth. Males can spray venom out of spurs on their hind legs that can be lethal to competing mates. Though not lethal to humans, this venom can certainly cause a good amount of pain and swelling. Koalas When spotting a koala hanging onto a tree branch and chewing on a leaf, the first thought for most of us is that this species is just an utterly cute animal. But don't be fooled. While they do look slow and quite docile, they can easily flip that switch and fall into a world of all-out aggression. Koalas have an extra set of reproductive organs, and this could very well be a contributing factor to their short temper. You might treat them to an earful of baby talk when you see one behind bars at the zoo, but these animals wouldn't take it in the wild. They are known to jump out of trees and charge people who annoy them. Sea otters Sea otters are pretty cute, but don't think that you can just jump into a river and start swimming with them. These cute animals are utterly insane about their territory. Getting in their way will likely result in these bashful cuties transforming into one of the most ferocious critters in the world. They may look lumbering, but these guys aren't easy to escape from. They can swim at speeds of up to 8 miles an hour, run as quick as 18 miles per hour, and are equipped with powerful jaws and sharp claws. They've been known to have invading alligators for lunch, so better not to take change and just admire them from afar. Moose Out of all the woodland creatures, moose are perhaps the most dangerous, and that's because encountering them isn't hard to do. They may walk with the same step of your everyday horse or cow, but they are about 100 times more touchy. They won't necessarily attack humans on sight, but they can if you annoy the heck out of them. Accomplishing this isn't hard to do. All you have to do is look them in the eyes or breathe too loudly, and that's when they'll charge. If you happen to cross paths with a moose, the best thing to do is just walk around it. Don't snap a photo, avoid eye contact, and most important, don't try to pet it. Elephants Elephants are the biggest dry land animals to walk the earth. They are also some of the cutest animals out there. While they are some of the most intelligent creatures on the planet, they also have the potential to be extremely dangerous. This especially goes for young male elephants. They are prone to attacking villages and other animals in an effort to vent their internal aggressions. We don't even need to mention what an angry elephant is capable of. While they look friendly and pettable, it is not advised to approach one of these extraordinary animals in the wild. While trained elephants may be accustomed to human interaction, the same is certainly not true in their natural habitats. Dingoes While dingoes may look a lot like a more rugged version of your average pet dog, they are far from your average house pooch. Before cuddling with a wild dingo, know that these animals are savage, wild, and carriers of disease. A dingo may look like a playful pup, but it has the heart of a wolf and is one of the most dangerous animals in its native habitat of Australia. These animals run in packs and won't hesitate to take something down quick and make a meal out of it. Sure, they're pretty cute, but you'd probably think otherwise with a rabid pack of them at your heels. You're better off petting a nice poodle next time you feel the urge. Beavers 
It's easy to suffer from a cuteness overload when you see an adorable little beaver swimming through the water. You might even feel inclined to dive right into those waters and start swimming alongside with them. Before you do so, remember that beavers spend a lot of time biting through trees. Beavers are unique in the fact that their teeth never stop growing. Biting through trees all day effectively file down their teeth to a manageable size. Beavers aren't the types to look for trouble, however, if harassed, they will take those teeth to their tormentors, and this is usually something that won't end pretty. Poison Dart Frogs Amphibians don't exactly have a reputation for being the cutest animals on the planet. At least that's what most people think before getting an eye load of the poison dart frog. Despite how cute this little guy is, the last thing you want to do is hold one in your hands. As its name indicates, one of these can literally be the last thing you ever hold. This cute little frog's skin produces a venom that'll almost instantly paralyze and quickly kill predators that touch it. We can't say that these dangerous darts didn't come with some biological warning signs, though. The bright colors that it sports are a way of warning others to stay clear if they know what's good for them. Prairie Dogs on paper, prairie dogs make for perfect pets. These little cuties are very intelligent and are extremely social. They definitely seem like they'd be happy to see their owners come home after hours at work. Sadly, these animals have lots of predators in the wild and their natural instinct is to bite when they feel scared or threatened. A bite here or there doesn't seem like such a problem. Most rodents aren't above biting their owners once in a while, but it's best to think twice before these cousins of the common squirrel. However, the prairie dog is a carrier of the bubonic plague. This is the same disease that is estimated to have wiped out 30 to 60% of Europe's population in the 14th century. This definitely puts them among the most dangerous animals out there. Ostriches. Birds can be some of the most dangerous animals on the planet, and the ostrich is no exception. They may look whimsical and silly, but these creatures can do a lot of damage. Ostriches are very territorial in nature, and entering their space will likely result in an altercation. This is one beast that you do not want to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with. If you come across one of these birds in the wild, the best thing to do is stay quiet and slowly walk away. They can peck and bite hard enough, but when in battle, they usually rely on their four-inch talons, which are sharp enough to puncture organs with ease. <laughs>